sketchy janitor is selling some sketchy biscuits. Hey everyone, it's Ethan from GameSlide and welcome back to another one of my videos and today I'm going to be playing Kindergarten 1. Because the whole rage now, or at least it was like two weeks ago, I think it still is now, right? But yeah, I really wanted to play Kindergarten 2 because I watched a little bit of Jacksepticeye's video and it looks so much fun. But to play Kindergarten 2, I have to play Kindergarten 1. So we're going to be doing both of them, which I'm excited about. I haven't played this. I'm ready. Let's go! I honestly don't even know what this is about. I literally, like, you go to kindergarten. Like, what else? What else happened? Oh, it's Monday. So do we go, like, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday? Unnecessary, but okay. Oh, we got some money. Can I just take all of it? Okay, so we just took all of our money. I, it looks like we need to unlock items. I'm already starting another day. Yes! Okay. Let's go. Who's this? Hmm, I smell- wait, he I want to do the voices just like Mod Father, so, um, he looks like a bully brute. Hmm, I smell money. Yeah, someone is definitely carrying more than three dollars around here. Oh, I can't bring more than three dollars or else he'll attack me. Hey kid, you carrying any cash? No. Don't lie to me, I know when I smell money. Give me half or else. No! Will he kill me though? Fine. Good boy, though. Don't go telling the teacher about this or you might, not, might end up missing like that Billy kid. Who's Billy? <laughs> well, that was highlighted, so can we tell the teacher? Hi, I'm Miss Applegate. I've been well endowed. Ahem, with excellent teaching qualities. This British action, accent just came on, so I'll just go with it. Bugs stole my money. His name is Bugs. Oh my god. He did? Interesting. I'll make you a deal. Bugs is a real troublemaker. He's violent and a danger to others. If you go over there and challenge him, I'll make it worth your while. What if he hurts me? It'll build character! Is this legal? Probably not, but if this is how I can stop my underground kid fighting ring, then it's a risk I'm willing to take. What's in it for me? I'll give you a gold star. We all love gold stars, don't we? Okay, why not? Oh, I love a good kitty fight. Just go over there and push him a little bit. When he when he attacks back, just yell for me, and I'll put a stop to it. Okay, <laughs> I'm scared. What do you want, Dweeb? Not giving you your money back. Get out of here before I squish you. Squishing me won't make your dad come back. My dad will come back. He just went out to the store to get some cigarettes. Is all. Get out of here. I'll beat you so hard it'll make him proud. <laughs> He'll never be proud of you. Yes, he will. If you don't leave right now, I'll kill you. Dying wouldn't be so bad. Fine, you asked for it. This is for you, Dad. Don't accept my fear. Call for teacher. Bugs! Bugs, how dare you attack another student unprovoked again. That's the last straw. I'm sending you to- uh, I'm sending you to the principal's office so he can finally expel you. No, please don't. He started it. He's a liar. He said my dad was never coming back. Well, it's, it's probably true. Well, he's right, and after this little incident, ne neither are you. Now go to the principal's office, or I'll have the janitor carry you there. But, but, go. Stupid rat, we could have been friends if you didn't rat me out. Okay. So does everyone have, like, different missions? Oh, happy day. I'm finally rid of that little degenerate. Here's your gold star, as promised. Thanks. Hmm, now, you've got me thinking, though. Jerome thinks he's so high and mighty because he's the principal's kid. Why don't we arrange a little trip for him to visit Daddy? Maybe we could. Is this her mission? Oh, that's what I like to hear. Come see me during morning time and I'll tell you what to do. See ya then, bitch. So, I want to get to know, who is this? I don't know what voice to do for her. Ow, oh, <laughs> What was that? Oh, um, hey, I'm Billy. You've probably heard about what happened to my brother, Billy. <laughs> we'll go with him. I haven't, so Billy's her brother, and Billy went missing. Okay. You haven't? It's been all over the news. They went missing a few days ago. Sorry to hear that. Thanks. That makes you one of the few people that even seems to care. Ever since he went missing, people either ignore him or insult me. Cindy has been trying to put gum in my hair. Who's Cindy? That bitch down there? Oh, she's blonde. Oh, she must be like the bean girl. Why? I don't know, but if I were you, I'd stay away from her. She's drilling me. Thanks for the tip. 
Oh my god, I just realized. Look at my face. It's all bloody. <laughs> right, so hi, Cindy. Hey there, cutie. Want I'm Cindy. Want me my boyfriend? I don't know. Is there like a tutorial that I can play? Hints. Oh, what is this? You need to get rid of bugs in the schoolyard. Start the day with more than three dollars. You need a special item from the teacher program you complete bugs mission. So yeah, the all the characters all have their own different missions. You need a special item from Jerome and as much money as you can carry to complete Monty's mission. Start the day by getting robbed by bugs and toddling on him. You need to have the cigarettes by the time you get to the laser pointer from the bathroom. You need a special item from Cindy, okay. So Cindy's mission looks like it's first. So I'll just do Cindy's mission first, since it's like the first one here, and then we'll move on to that guy's whoever he is, and then just move on to Miss Teachers. Yeah. So sure, we'll be your except do we need more apples because they look like they run out and then the thing is. <laughs> That's a wrong person. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. And we'll totally be the cutest couple in school, but first we have to do something for me. Like what? See that girl over there? That's Lily. She is by far the ugliest, nastiest girl you will ever meet. I want you to take this gum and stick it in her hair during morning time. Got it? I don't want to, though. She seems nice. Oh, we're doing her mission anyway. Oh, yay! This is gonna be so great! She'll finally get what she deserves, just like her brother did for dumping me, and that's why she hits her. Come find me for morning time after you've done it. What happened to her brother? You haven't heard? He went missing. His disappearance totally stole the thunder from my dog. Bis he's going missing. Oh, I guess I guess everyone just cares more about him than they do about me. Well, you seem like kind of a bitch, but I do care about your dog. Your dog went missing too? Yeah, I brought I brought her in for showman's help, but the janitor said dogs aren't allowed, so he took her. Apparently she escaped from his closet and they couldn't find her. Maybe I could find your dog instead. Hmm, interesting proposal. I do miss Biscuit. The question is, do I love Biscuit more than I hate Lily? You love Biscuit more. Um, no. No, I definitely hate Lily more. What the hell, bitch? Yeah, Lily is actually- oh, did I cry something? Yeah, Lily is actually a despicable person, and her existence bothers me. Don't worry about Biscuit, just put that gum in her hair during morning time and come talk to me afterward. Okay, you got it. That's the janitor that took her dog. He seems sketchy. Hello! How you doing there, Sonny? <laughs> Don't mind the old janitor here, just sweeping up after you silly cretins. Sweepy, sweepy, sweepy. That's a moth. Ah, so it is. You're also mopping the sidewalk. I'll be mopping your blood off it if you don't skedaddle, jeez! I don't want to skedaddle. I'm a man of my word. You're gonna kill me? Okay, this is a much more violent game than I thought. I thought we were just gonna go to kindergarten and have a nice day. I didn't know we were gonna be able to die. Um, restart the room. Okay, it's actually good. Oh my god, bugs. Although, wait. Didn't Cindy's mission say um, you need to get rid of bugs in the schoolyard? Yeah. You need. So, this is good, actually. We need to get rid of him. Hey, kid. You, um, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, we've seen this. Whatever. We can skip the whole teacher sending bugs to the principal's office thing because we've already seen all of this. Also, I think I'm going to do like one mission per episode. Wait, how many missions are there? Wait, I didn't look at these. What are these? Uh, bugs will give you cactus. I love giving cigarettes. Free sky gem is in one of the cubbies. Cards? Are they my collectibles? <gasps> oh, it's like the backpacks in Spider-Man. Okay, so we've got collectible cards too. Um... I don't know if I'll collect all them, but uh, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have seven missions. So eight episodes if I do collect all the cards. Yeah, so about eight episodes of this, which isn't bad. So yeah, I'll do uh, one mission per episode. So we'll do Cindy's this time. Okay, so I got the gum. Oh my god, to stick it in Lily's her in morning time, during morning time. Who are you? Hi, my friends call me Nugget. Oh, they would if I had any. Nugget knows no friendship since Lily went missing. <laughs> Do I want to waste my last apple? Why not? We'll t what happened to Billy? Billy is missing. Poor Nugget misses Billy, but Nugget cannot help him now. It is too late. Do you know where he is? Nugget does not know. Nugget knows who knows. Who knows? Your questions upset poor Nugget. You push too hard. Nugget needs his pills. Go. Much better. What were we talking about? Billy. Ho? I don't know what you're talking about. 
We were talking about him, you're speaking normally now, what's in those pills? Um, I want to know more, what, this seems sketchy. We were not, the principal has forbidden me from speaking about it, and if you press me any further, I'll report you to him. Will the principal kill me? Oh, I'm so curious, I just want to know. No, you don't. Enjoy your trip to the principal's office. Whatever, Nugget. The principal has just called me. He wants to see you in his office. What did you and this little weirdo do? That's a good question. We'll get going then. The principal is an impatient man. Fine. Okay. Wow. <laughs> um, under the purple rug. There's... There's blood. Um... Do I want to know? Does... So is Billy under there? Is Billy's body under there? What's under there? He has guns. And it looks like someone was trying to claw their way away from there. Um, okay. I don't know what voice to do for him though. Um... So I've been told you're feeling bad about Billy. <laughs> Oh, that really shows off my double chin. Who told you that? Oh, you know, just, uh, where it gets around, you know, it doesn't matter how I know, it's that I do know. Okay, so what about it? That's all this is about, right? Billy's missing and it's making you sad. You're not trying to find him or anything, you're just sad he's gone. Right. Phew. Okay, that makes this a whole lot easier. So here's what you're gonna do. I'm gonna give you something, and I want you to take it whenever you're feeling sad about Billy. What is it? Just pills. Just a little something I ordered for this exact reason here. Take one whenever you miss Billy too much, okay? You're giving me pills? Just don't tell anyone you got them from me. The hall monitor is waiting to take you back to class. Please head outside. Okay. <laughs> this is really, really sketchy. Can I go look at that? This rug seems a little... Ignore the word. Oh, I can't lift it then. It does look out of place. There's blood underneath it. There's claw marks there. Uh, I don't like this. So I guess the principal kidnapped Billy. Welcome back. I hope everything turned out okay with the principal. Everything is everything is fine. Say, the principal didn't happen to have given you anything, did he? Give me some pills, why? Oh, lucky day, you wouldn't mind if your lovely teacher had one now, would you? Be my guess. I don't know what's in them. They did a new hint. Good boy. Go oh, that's nice. Thank you for that. Go on and enjoy the rest of your morning time. I know I will. Me too. Thanks, miss. Person. I forget your name, Miss something. Okay, so Cindy wants me, right? Well, what are you waiting for? Stick the gum in- Oh, yes! I forgot, I'm just stick the gum in Lily's hair. Oh, well, I don't really do the whole morning buddy thing anymore. My brother Billy was normally my buddy, but he's missing. You're from New York now, Lily, okay? Deal with it. We're gonna put the gum in Lily's hair. Did you just- Oh, you did. You just put gum in my hair. That's so mean. Cindy put you up to this, didn't she? Well, I don't care. Leave me alone. I feel bad. But we got to do our mission, so... Did you do it? Oh my gosh, she totally did. Wow, what happened? What did she say? Did she cry? I bet she cried. She cried. Yes, I'm so happy. Now you can be my morning buddy, which also makes you my boyfriend. As, as my boyfriend, you get the honor of playing house with me. Okay, then. Um... But before we do that, you need to get cleaned up. No way any boyfriend of mine is going to bleed all over me. Go to the bathroom and wash up. I'll be over by the dollhouse. Okay. So we gotta go to the bathroom. Can we just walk out? Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. You can't just leave class without a pass. Class. Pass. Pass. Class. Whatever. Okay, can I use the bathroom? I don't know. Can you? I hate when teachers do that. It's not necessary. May I use the bathroom? Of course. Now that you've asked correctly, here's the bathroom pass. Gee, thanks. Just be back soon. Sure. I will. Who are you? Why would you let me pass? Not so fast there, little dude. I'm gonna need to see your hall pass before I can let you by. Here's my pass. Oh, he's the hall monitor. Okay, I'll let you pass, but I can't let you any further than the bathroom. That's fair. I'm not even going to ask. I just came here to wash up. That's what I'm gonna do. It's a sink. <laughs> Thank you. 
Wash off blood. Now we can get back to Cindy and play house with her. Oh, you're back. I'll take that bathroom pass back now. Go back to your morning time. Okay, hi Cindy. Welcome home, husband. I hope work wasn't too hard because you're going to make be making me dinner tonight. Why do I have to make dinner? Because I've been so busy man maintaining the house and I... Sniff, sniff. Have you been drinking again? What? Um, no honey, I'm just tired. Oh sure you are, you're always so tired. I'm sure you wouldn't mind blowing into this then. Is that a breathalyzer? You bet it is, and if you blow so much as 0.01, I'm calling your sponsor. I'll take the test. Good. Blow. 0.32? You're trash right now, how could you do this to me? You said you'd be sober, how can you be a father when you can't even take care of yourself? Be a father? I, well, while you were in prison, it, it's probably not yours. I'm sorry, I guess I have my own set of problems to deal with. This is the most intense scheme of heist I have ever seen, especially in a kindergarten. I love it. You cheated on me? I want a divorce, we can work through this. Um, uh, we can work through this because I want to get this mission done. Sniff, you think so? No, you feel the <laughs> I really want to say that, but no, I'll say yes, I do. Wow, alcoholism aside, you're a really great guy. So, what should we do about the baby? Keep it or abort it? Oh, let's keep it. That's so wonderful that you would do that. Thank you. No problem. Wow, that was the most fun <laughs> I've had playing house in a while. You're going to make a splendid boyfriend. I want you to have lunch with me. Okay. Great, I'll see you then. Sure. <laughs> Okay, kids, that's the lunch bell. Let's go to the cafeteria for a nutritious meal. I hear we're having slop today. How exciting. Slop. Hi, Cindy. Oh, hey, boyfriend. Oh, hey, boyfriend. I saved you a spot. Go get something to eat and come sit with me. This lunch lady looks so angry. <laughs> so funny. How you doing there, Sunny? <laughs> Wanna taste some nutritious slop for lunch? Yes, please. There you go, buddy boy, and don't be shy about coming back for seconds. Plenty of slot to go around. Hi, Cindy. Oh, hey, boyfriend. I saved you a spot. Go get something to eat and come sit with me. I have some slop. Oh, good. I was just thinking about... Oh, darn it. My stupid mother packed me something that's not vegan. She's a vegan. She knows I'm all vegan right now. God, that woman is insufferable. Oh. Hey, sweetie. Would you be a darling and go get me something vegan? Something vegan? Yeah, you know, um, like, I don't know exactly what it means, but I know it's good. So just ask around and see if you can find something vegan. Oh, and the slop isn't vegan. Damn. I'll try. The sketchy janitor is selling some sketchy biscuits. Are they vegan? Biscuit balls. Come get your biscuit balls here. Get them while they're hot. Biscuit balls? My own recipe. Came up with, with it after a little incident that happened recently. What's in them? Whatever's in a biscuit, and a little something extra. It's the extra part that worries me. Oh, come on, try it. It won't kill you. I'm much of that. They're a buck a piece. Quite a deal if I do say so myself. And I'm sure your little friend Cindy would eh, love to try one. Why would Cindy want to try one? Just a he. <laughs> Just a hunch I have. Go on and give her one. I'm sure she'll love it. You're being creepy about it. I'm always creepy, you just give her a damn biscuit. Did you drug it or something? Is he gonna kill me again? What? Of course not, I'm not that kind of janitor. This is something else, something a bit more entertaining. She wants something vegan, is that vegan? Vegan, ha! You're her boyfriend. <laughs> wow, talk about setting the bar low. I'll make you a deal. What's the deal? I'll give you the biscuit ball for free! Don't worry, hehehe. <laughs> it's vegan. I'll also throw in one of them Monster Monk cards. All you gotta do is make sure she eats it. What do you say? Deal. Good, come back when she's downed it. Uh, okay. <laughs> what did you get me? This thing. That's vegan, are you sure? <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, I trust you. <laughs> munch munch. Hey, that's pretty good. It kinda reminds me of my dog in a way.
She said the janitor took her dog. Oh my god, her dog is the something extra in the biscuit. <laughs> what the hell? That's so messed up. Oh my god, she just at her dog. No problem. You're being so good to me today. You're probably the most well-trained boy I've ever met. I should use you for something at recess. So I accidentally wasn't recording and skipped some stuff, but like, um... She wants us to do something to Lily at recess. Jerome was telling me how the ja oh, Jerome was telling me how the janitor has all sorts of gross stuff in his closet. I'm thinking we find something to give to Lily. Doesn't he keep it locked? Oh, you don't have to worry about that. Look what I have. You have a key. Yep, a girl has her ways. I'm gonna head over and pay off the lunch lady so you can get going on down to that nasty closet. What about the hall monitor? Oh, that silly boy. He'll be in the bathroom having a cigarette. Just don't go in there and you'll be fine. Okay, let's hope I don't go in the wrong door. <laughs> Lunch is almost over, so listen for the bell while you're in there. The janitor will come back shortly after it rings, so get out as soon as possible. Let's do this speech. You're good to go. Hurry back. Okay. Oh, one of the cars is in there. I didn't even notice that before. But, um, okay, so that's the bathroom. Don't go in there. Go in here. This is the door to the janitor's closet. It's locked. Unlock the door, and we are in, bitch. Stolen stuff. I don't want to look in there. Right, so we need to find something to prank Lily with. Okay, for some reason, when I walked into this janitor's closet, my brain didn't, like, process that there was a giant body bag of blood everywhere and a bucket full of blood. This janitor... <sighs> Actually, I think the janitor, this is my theory, I haven't seen the end of the game so I don't know, but maybe the janitor and the principal are working together to like, murder children, which is really bad. Maybe the janitor is the one who murdered Billy. Uh, it's a bucket that's catching the blood from that thing on the table. This would be a truly bad thing to dump on someone's head. You gotta hear the bell just ring. Oh, did the slop give you the runs? Sorry about that. I hope it worked itself out. All the other kids are at recess now. Go run along. Okay. Bye. Ooh, recess. Okay, I'll see you. Cindy, I got you something gross. Wow, what did you get? This bucket filled with blood. Oh. My. God. It's perfect! That is so disgusting. Whose blood is it? Never mind. I don't want to know. I don't want to know either. You're the best. Climb up there and I'll call her over. Hey, Lily, come over here. I want to show you something. Why can't you just leave me alone, Cindy? I'm Kermit now for some reason. I'm so sick of you harassing me. I'm not gonna harass you, Kermit. We can be friends. Just come over here. Fine. What is it? Oh, Lily, that's such a bad move. I'm sorry! Oh! <laughs> uh, oh! <laughs> What did you just- Oh, you and your awful boyfriend set me up again. I'm so done with this, you've made me miserable for so long. What? Aw, oh, come on, I think it's an improvement. You're just so mean, I can't take it anymore. What is she doing? What is she doing? Goodbye, cruel world- Wow, that hole is deep. Do you think she died? Never mind, I don't care. You should come down from there. <laughs> she fell in Nugget's hole. <laughs> oh my god. That was so great. It made me so happy today. I want you to take this flower. It's pretty, like me. <laughs> this way you'll always have a piece of me with you. Thanks, Cindy. Now you'll have the best thing ever for show and tell. We have show and tell, too. Gosh, I'm so great. Oh dear, has anyone seen Lily? I don't see her anywhere. She fell in Nugget's hole. Nugget saw where the girl fell. Nugget knows. Shut up, Nugget. You didn't see anything. Nugget, I swear to whatever god your messed up family believes in, if Lily fell down that hole you dug, I'm pushing you in after her. Nugget will not give Teacher the satisfaction. Teacher will never take Nugget alive. Wow, that hole is deep. I can't even see the bottom. We're gonna have to get the janitor out here with that ladder to get them out. Oh, Mr. Janitor! You're welcome. I'm coming, I'm coming. What seems to be the problem there, Miss Jigglytuff? <laughs> oh my god. It's Applegate, and I have two of my students stuck at the bottom of this hole. You want me to... Put the rest of them in the hole. <laughs> no, I want you to get the ones that are in the hole out of the hole. Can you do that? Oh, well, 
that's less fun, but I guess I can do that. It might take a while, though. It might be best if you brought the ones that aren't in the hole back inside so I don't get confused. Very well. Okay, children, we're gonna cut the recess a little short today. Let's head inside for show and tell. Okay. And Cindy wants us, Cindy wants us to show her little flower thing. I hope everyone had a good recess. Let's all get ready for show and tell. Why don't you go first? What did you bring me? I brought Cindy's flower. A flower? That's pretty boring. What's there even to tell about that? It's not boring. I gave him that because he's been a good boyfriend all day. Trust me, only oh, hint. Trust me, it's boring. We're just gonna skip you and move on to someone more interesting. Okay, who's next? It's gonna be hard. It's, it's not gonna be hard to beat that, so don't be shy. Oh, we don't see everyone else. Well, children, that was a fun little show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you all had a fun day today. I'll see you all tomorrow. Yay. Oh, we're talking to Cindy. I didn't talk to them two. Those two kids. Um, that was so sweet of you to show the flower to everyone. You really are the best boyfriend I've ever had. You can keep it forever and always. I'll be seeing you tomorrow, boyfriend. See you then. Deck and play! And we got Cindy's flower, which is, seems to be an important item to complete the other missions. Oh, we earned money. Oh, we only have 259 because Bugs took it all. He got sent to the principal, didn't he? Oh, he's probably dead. <laughs> Mondag Ian. Okay, so we don't go through the big- Ew! We got Cindy's flower! This is Cindy. This is the flower Cindy gave me for being a good boyfriend all day. Perhaps I could show it to someone who needs a little love in their life. Lily, maybe? Okay. Anyway, that was Cindy's mission. It was a wild ride, and I I already love this game. Not only do I love the art style, but I love the story, because the story seems amazing. We're just all gonna kill each other. So yeah, if you enjoyed this first episode, don't forget to leave a like and hit the subscribe button down below. It's down there somewhere, go look for it, click on it, and you'll join us on our amazing adventure. I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!